Joanna. Oh, we're live? Yeah. Okay. Good morning, everyone. Good to see you. Thank you for joining us again at Tot Stop Song and Story Time. Me and Zoe Anna are really excited this morning. We've got some fun things planned for you this morning. Now, if you haven't already got an instrument, a little bit later for our song time, you're going to need an instrument or you're going to need a shaker. I've got my shaker ready for you this morning. Look, it's right up here. <coughs> Mine's like this little egg shaker. So if you've got something like that at home, you can go and get that ready for our songs and our stories this morning. Now make sure you comment if you're watching so I can say hello. I've got my phone here to see. Let's see. <coughs> Who's watching? Ariana, hello Ariana, good to see you this morning. And Lionheart, and who else do we have? Nikki, hello Nikki. And Sophie, hello Sophie, say hi to Sophie. Hi Sophie. It's cousin Sophie. Yeah, I know. Who else do we have? We've got Kaylee, and Gary, and Sienna. Hello, Sienna. I'm glad you're watching again this morning. Good to see you. Who else have we got this morning? Jackie. Hello, Jackie. Lovely to see you this morning. And Wendy. I'm glad you can tune in, Wendy. And you're being a part of Top Stop still. We miss you. You do a great job making all those drinks for us and cutting all the fruit every Monday. Let's see, Karen. Hello, Karen, and your little one. Good to see you this morning. And Charlotte, Newport. I'm glad you could join us. Oh, Holly Aru. Hello, Holly Aru. I hope you're doing well. Have you been on any walks this week, or have you done anything at home, any craft or anything? I'm glad you can join us this morning. Let's see, who else do we have here? We've got Jackson. Oh yes, Karen's Jackson. Hello Jackson, really great to see you. And I think you posted a picture of you doing some craft shell printing and leaf printing. Is that right? I'm really glad that you posted for us to see. You did a really great job, Jackson, at doing all of that. Well done. And let's see, who else do we have? We've got, oh, Florence and Maisie. Hello, Florence and Maisie. I'm glad you could join us this morning. And I wanted to say thank you also to Lionheart. You've posted a really great picture of you doing some painting. So thank you for posting that. Who else have we got here watching this morning? Granny Libby, Joanna is watching us. Hi, Hi Margaret. <clears throat> and Leighton. Hello, Leighton. I'm glad you could join us again this morning. Have you got your shaker ready, Leighton? Do you have something you should, can shake? <clears throat> Sorry, I've got a scratchy throat. Um, who else have we got here? Granny and Granddad. Oh, Yale's watching with Medina. Hello, Medina. I'm glad you could join us this morning. Really good to see you all this morning. Do you all have a shaker you can have this morning to do some songs with? I hope you can bring those with you. Now, if there's any birthdays this week, make sure you comment your birthday and how old you are so later we can sing you happy birthday. And also, there's a special song somebody requested for me to do this morning. I think Rosella requested speckled frogs, three little speckled frogs. Now, I really want to do the speckled frog song, but I can't find my speckled frogs. So this morning, or in a minute, I want you to look around and see if you can find my three speckled frogs. And if you comment and say where they are, then we can find them to do the song, because we can't do the song without the speckled frogs, can we? So I hope that you can find my speckled frogs for me. Do you think they'll find them, Zoeanna? Yeah. Do you think they've got good eyes to find my speckled frogs? Okay, let's see. Oh, Fatima and Medina. Yes, hello, Fatima and Medina. Good to see you. And Lisa's joined. Lisa's joined. Hello, James and Charlotte. You say hi to James and Charlotte? Hi, Charlotte and James. Jimmy! <laughs> you, were, you were talking to Charlotte yesterday, weren't you? You had a nice chat on video chat, weren't you? Playing with your toys together on video chat. Hello, Jane, money. Nice to see you. I think it's Freddie you have, isn't it, Jane? I hope 
hope so. <laughs> and Emily with Ollie. Hello, Emily. Hello, Ollie. I'm really glad you could join us this morning. Okay. Oh, Granny said, Granddad can play the coat and she can use a saucepan lids and symbols. Great idea. Yeah. If you have a comb or a saucepan, you could use that for your instrument. Really funny. You have to get a little video and send it to us, Granny and Granddad, of you playing the comb and the saucepan. Hello, Ida. Great to see you this morning, Ida. I'm glad you could join us. And Carrie Kemp is watching this morning. Andrew Denham is watching. I thought you meant to be at work, Andrew. Isn't Andrew meant to be at work this morning? Oh. Yeah. Uh, he couldn't miss a talk stop episode, could he? Could be watching yeah. at work. <clears throat> Maybe he's watching at work. Jane Corbett, hello. And who else? Marcel. Hello, Marcel. I'm really glad you could join us. I think we're nearly ready to do some songs. Thank you, everyone, who sent in pictures of your lions you made. Bethany made a really great lion head. Did you see the lion head that Bethany made? Yeah, just like the one that you made on Thursday. <clears throat> so that was really great. And... Some other people posted some lovely pictures on, which we're really grateful for. I think we're nearly all ready. If you've got your shakers ready, just put them aside for a minute. And we're going to stand up and do some songs. Right, shall we do some stretching first? Stretch really high. Let me see you stretching high, everyone. And stretching really low. Touch the ground. And spread your arms really wide. There we go. And make like a big star shape. And now wave your arms in the wind like trees and branches in the wind. Back and forth. Okay, we're going to do a big wiggle. Are you ready? One, two, three. Everybody wiggle! Wiggle, 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 wiggle! Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle! Okay, I hope you're joining in all the wiggles. We're going to start with three little monkeys jumping on the bed. Are you ready? Three little monkeys jumping on the bed. One fell off and bumped his head. Mommy called the doctor and the doctor said, No more monkeys jumping on the bed. Two little monkeys jumping on the bed. One fell off and bumped his head. Mommy called the doctor, and the doctor said, No more monkeys jumping on the bed. One little monkey jumping on the bed. He fell off and bumped his head. Mommy called the doctor, and the doctor said, No more monkeys jumping on the bed. Well done. I hope you don't jump on your bed at home because you could fall off and bump your head. I hope you're still looking for my frogs because we're meant to be singing three little speckled frogs next. And I don't know where the frogs are. Do you want to bring your camera around? Has anyone commented yet on where the frogs might be? No. No? Okay, let's look around here. Are there any frogs there? I need you to comment if you can find my frogs. Okay, and up at the top now. Where are my three speckled frogs? Can anyone find my three speckled frogs? Any comments of where my frogs might be? <clears throat> oh, we got one Rosella by the bay. Here it is. Thank you, Rosella. We can sing one speckled frog now, but where's my other two speckled frogs? Because we can only find one. Has anyone else commented where the speckled frogs might be? I wonder where they are. That's not a speckled frog. <laughs> That's not a speckled frog. That's my wedding photo. Okay. Shall we get Zoe Anna to find them if no one else can see them? Have a look, Zoyanna. Where's is, another one? Is this a speckled frog? No. Where's the other is speckled, speckled frog? Is this a speckled frog? Emma said near the clock. Near the this clock? This is a speckled frog. Who said that? Frog. Emma. Emma. Well done, Emma. You found it near the mm. clock. And where's my other speckled frog? Is that frog? a speckled frog? <clears throat> Yale said that as well. Huh? Yale said it? Yeah, well done, frog. Yale. Thank you, well, everyone, for finding my speckled frogs. You all did a really good job. 
One was by the teddy bear, one was under the clock, and one was inside my little lantern. We now have all three speckled frogs. Great eyes for spotting them. Okay, can you hold one for me, Zoeana? And I'll hold the other two. Are you ready? You can hold up three fingers. One, two, three. Three little speckled frogs sat on a speckled log, eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Then there were two green speckled frogs. Glub, glub. Two little speckled frogs sat on a speckled log, eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. yum. One jumped into <laughs> the pool where it was nice and cool. Then there was one green speckled frog. Glub, glub. One little speckled frog sat on a speckled log, eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. He jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Then there were no green speckled frogs. Glub, glub. Well done. Right, we have time for one or two favorite songs, but first I'm going to say hello to Amy. Thank you for joining us, Amy. And Isaac, really glad you could join us this morning, Isaac. Hello, Kirsty. Kirsty's joined us as well. Who else have we got? Alex and Rebecca. Hello, Alex, and hello, Rebecca. And Allie, you've joined us as well. I'm really glad you could join us, Allie. We miss having you at Top Stop. You and Bethan did a great job doing the art and craft for all the children. I hope we can all come back soon and do lots of fun things together. But it's great we can meet like this. Now, do we have any favorite songs this morning? Oh, Najwa. Najwa. Hello, Najwa. I'm really glad. Jerusalem. Wow, that's such a long way away. I can't believe you've joined us for songs this morning. Really glad you could join us. Sorry. Right. So, I think we'll do one more song while we wait for a favorite song. Where's my spider? Where did he go? Oh, stay there. I'm going to get my spider. Okay. <clears throat> okay, I'm back. Look. I've got a big, hairy, scary spider. He's quite big and scary, actually. Shall we do Incy Wincy Spider? I'm going to put him like this. Do you want to use him, Zoriana? Yes. You're going to pretend he goes up the water spill. I'll do my fingers like this. Make sure you get your spidery fingers out. Incy Wincy Spider claimed up the water spout. Down came the rain and washed the spider out. Out came the sunshine and dried up all the rain. So wincy, wincy spider climbed up the spout again. Yay! Well done. Right, we've got time for one favorite song before we move on. Okay, we've got... We are Wheels on the Bus by Marcel and Hopping Bunnies. Okay, we'll do those ones really quickly before we move on. Thank you, Emily, for the idea of Hopping Bunnies. Or is it Ollie who wants it? And Wheels on the Bus. So let's do Wheels on the Bus. The wheels on the bus go round and round, round and round, round and round. The wheels on the bus go round and round all day long. Now do the horn. The horn on the bus goes beep, 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 beep. The horn on the bus goes beep, 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 all day long. And the wipers on the bus go swish, 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 swish. The wipers on the bus go swish, 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 all day long. What do the mummies do? I think they go chatter, don't they? Yeah. The mummies on the bus go chatter, 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 chatter. The mummies on the bus go chatter, chatter, chatter all day long. And the parcels, don't forget them. The parcels on the bus go crash, bang, wallop, crash, bang, wallop, crash, bang, wallop. The parcels on the bus go crash, bang, wallop. All day long. Well done. I 
can see you've all done really great actions with us for that song. Lastly, we're going to do Sleeping Bunnies. Okay. Here we go. So, Anna, do you want to hold the baby bunny? Okay. And hello, Quinton. I'm glad you could join us. You're just in time for Sleeping Bunnies. And Auntie Jo. We can see Auntie Jo. Can you say hi to Auntie Jo this morning? Hi. Um, yeah, I've done Amy and Isaac. I've done all those ones already. Okay, so make sure you're like a tiny bunny. I want you to curl up on the floor, fast asleep, like a tiny little bunny, just like Zoe Anna's doing. Are you ready? See the little bunny sleeping till it's nearly noon. Shall we wake the with a merry tune? Oh, so
they should be up anyhow. It's after 10 o'clock. I mean, really, it's quite late in the morning. Right? I have something special to show you now. So pop your instruments on the side, and we'll see what we've got. Okay. Just sit back up here a second. Huh? case. I wonder what's inside. This is Granny Libby's case, Zoeanna. She gave this one to us. I'm glad she did because we get to store some really fun things inside. Shall we look and see what's inside my special old case? Oh, did you hear that? I wonder what it is. Can you hear that? Shall we open and have a look? It's a noisy case, isn't it? There's something yeah. noisy inside, I think. Oh, wow! Right, just sit back up. Look at this! There's some instruments inside my case! Look at the colorful instruments! Shall we have a look at them and see what they all are? Does anyone know what this is called? This is called a tambourine. Do you want to hear it? Tambourine's loud, isn't it? Let's put the tambourine down. Right, what else do we have? Ooh, we've got a rain stick. You know, we sang Peter Patter raindrops, didn't we? Wow, do any of you have one of these at home? That sounds a lot like rain, doesn't it? Here's our rain stick. Zoeanna, do you want to do these ones for me? These are, well, they look like giraffes, but I don't think they're really giraffes, are they? Do you want to shake these? They're called maracas. Do you want to shake these for everyone? Well done. Pop them down here. They make a nice shaky sound, maracas do. What else do we have in here? What's this shiny one? Do you know what to do with this? Do I blow in it? Shall we find yeah. out? Let me blow into this. Oh, it's a harmonica. Can you say harmonica? Harmonica. That's really good. It's a harmonica. We're going to put that down there. And we've got some jingly bells. Some of you might have jingly bells at home. They always remind me of Father Christmas, jingle bells do. And what's this one here? This is a funny instrument. Hmm. It's a bit like a little drum, isn't it? I really like that one. And I've got another egg shaker, like my egg shaker I was using earlier. Oh, look at this, I've got two bells. I've got a big bell and a small bell. Now, can you listen really carefully and see how they sound? Here's the big bell. And here's the small one. They sound a lot different, don't they? It sounds different when it's big than when it's small. Let's put the bells down. And I've got a special whistle here. Let's have a listen. That's a fun whistle, it's a slide whistle. And I've got another instrument. No, oh, it's not working well. <laughs> it was a kazoo. It worked earlier when I tried it. Maybe, maybe it's going to try. Oh, it works a little bit, but not very good. Playing it wrong. And lastly, I've got this wooden instrument here. Do you know what it's called, Joseph? What does that remind you of? Clip, clop. It reminds me a bit of a horse going clip, clop, clip. Clop. And I've also got, what is this? A coconut. What is it? Coconut. Is that yours? It's a coconut shell. Shall we try hitting the coconut shell? See if that makes another noise. Really good. That makes a really good noise. Now, we are going to play an instrument game. And what I'm going to do is, 
We're going to put the camera on Zoeanna so you can't see the instrument, and I'm going to play an instrument, and you have to guess which one I'm playing. Have a look at them all. There's maracas, and there's a tambourine, and a whistle, and the harmonica, and all the rest of them. Okay, and then you have to guess. So you need to use your listening skills. This is a really good listening skill. So are you ready? Let me play my first instrument. Listen really well. Do you know what that one is? Have a look. Yes! You guessed right. Well done if you guessed the rain stick. Really good listening skills. Okay, let's try another one. Everyone really quiet now. Do you know which one that is? Have a look. Well done, it's the slide whistle. You guessed really well. Okay, let's guess another one. I wonder what that one is. Do you want to hear it again? That's right, have a look. It's the harmonica. Really good guess if you guessed harmonica. I think we have time for just two more. Which one shall I do? Hmm, two more. Okay. Listen really carefully for this one. Listen again. What do you think it is? Well done, it's the little bell. Some of you might have thought it's the big bell, but the little bell makes a different sound. Well done for guessing the little bell. We have time for one more instrument. Okay. Can anyone guess what that loud sound is? Shall I show you? Really good guess, it's my tambourine. Well done. You did a fantastic job. We don't have time to do all of the instruments, but if you've got an instrument at home, you could play this game, couldn't you? With your mom or dad or your sister or brother. Okay, now we're gonna do a story. This is a really nice story about some sounds. Let's see. This story is called Lucy Lamb. And Lucy Lamb is listening out for a sound. Let's find out what sound Lucy Lamb is listening out for. There's Lucy Lamb. It is spring on Yellow Barn Farm. Moo, says Mrs. Cow. I hear that the bluebells in Fernie Wood are wonderful this year. Bah, says Lucy Lamb. I should like to hear them. Lucy Lamb wants to hear the bluebells. Mm. So Lucy trots along the lane until she comes to Ferny Wood. Then Lucy stands. She looks around and she listens. Lucy can see lots of beautiful blue flowers swaying gently in the breeze. But she cannot hear any bells. I wonder where the bells are. Just then, Foxy Cub peeps through the trees. Where do the bluebells ring? asks Lucy. Oh, I don't know, says Foxy, but I should like to hear them. So Lucy trots further into the wood and Foxy Cub scampers after her. And there they are, looking for bluebells. Just then, Squirrel peeps through the leaves. Do you know where the bluebells ring? asks Lucy. No, says Squirrel, but it would be fun to find out. So Lucy trots further into the wood and Foxy Cub and Squirrel scamper after. Oh, I wonder if they'll find those bluebells and hear them ring. Just then Suki Rabbit peeps through the bracken. Do the bluebells ring here? asks Lucy. I have no idea, says Suki but I should like to know. So Lucy trots further into the wood and Foxy, Squirrel and Suki scampered after her. There's a little rabbit, Suki rabbit. 
Just then, Oliver Otter scrambles up the river. He wants to know what all the trotting and scampering is about. Can you tell us where the bluebells ring? asks Lucy Lamb. Oliver begins to smile. His smile gets wider and wider and then he begins to laugh. Can you see him laughing? I wonder why he's laughing. Bluebells don't ring, laughs Oliver, rolling on the grass and holding his tummy. They're flowers, they're all around you, look. The animals look at the bell shapes of the beautiful blue flowers. Then they look at Oliver rolling in the grass. There's Oliver laughing because they thought the bells would ring. Can you see these flowers? These flowers are called bluebells. They're in the shape of bells and they're blue. Very soon, Lucy, Foxy, Squirrel and Suki are rolling on the grass and laughing too. When all the animals stop laughing, they all agree that Mrs. Cow is right about the bluebells. They are really wonderful this year. There's all the animals and there's the really pretty bluebells. They got a bit confused, didn't they? They thought the bluebells would ring and they were listening. But the bell, bluebells were a flower. You might have gone out for a walk and seen some pretty bluebell flowers or different sort of flowers. If you have, you can post some photos for us to see. Now we made a shaker. Zoeana made. Where's your shaker, Zoeana? Um. Where have you put it? That on your side over there? Oh, there it is. Zoeana's going to tell you how she made the shaker. Oh, but first of all, oh, Ollie. Oh, I'm glad you really liked the game, Ollie. That's really good. It was a really fun game, wasn't it? And we'll do this game another time. Maybe in a few weeks' time we can do the instrument game again. We really enjoyed it. Okay, can you tell us how you made your shaker, Zoeana? So first you get a kitchen roll that has no paper on it. Then you get paper and put it around it to decorate it. Then you get one of some paper in the shape of a circle and put tape around it. Then you can put beans or rice in in the shaker. Then Finally, you do the same on the other side and cut a circle of paper and put the tape around it. That's really good. Now, do you want to shake it for us? Oh, well done. So, if you can make a shaker, you can make a shaker at home like this and do some dancing and singing with it. And if you make one, you can post it on our Facebook page so we can all have a look at it. It's been really nice to see what you've been up to when some of you has posted things. Well, I think we're going to say a prayer to finish today and then we'll do our goodbye song. So let's just close our eyes. Dear God, we thank you for all the beautiful flowers and trees, just like the bluebells in the story. We thank you for the instruments and all the sounds that we can hear when we're out in nature. Please be with us. Please help us to enjoy the things that we have. We are so grateful and thankful for them. Amen. Amen. That was lovely. I'm glad you joined us for prayer. Aren't there any birthdays this week? Has anyone said there's a birthday? We're going to do yours on My Thursday. birthday is next week. Yes, next week. We'll do yours next week. Don't you worry. No birthdays this week? Okay, well, I guess it's time to sing our goodbye song. So can we wave our arms really big like this? Are you ready? Goodbye everyone, goodbye everyone, time to go, time to go, very pleased to meet you, very pleased to meet you, come back soon, come back soon, bye bye everyone, and we look forward to seeing you again on Monday, about the same time. Have a really good weekend. And next week, we're going to be thinking about Easter and the Easter story. So bye-bye.